Justice for the family of a fallen police lieutenant, a judge sentencing her killer to death. It is a decision Lieutenant Deborah Clayton's family and friends and the Orlando community have been waiting for since her murder in 2017. The courtroom packed this morning as convicted killer Markeith Lloyd learned his fate. A sea of green and black law enforcement uniforms among the crowd there. Many of them worked alongside Lieutenant Clayton. Their reaction in a moment. First, though, News 6's Nadine Giannis is outside the Orange County Courthouse where Clayton's family said she can finally rest in peace. Well, it has been a long five years since the murder of Orlando Police Lieutenant Deborah Clay, and you can see her name memorialized outside the Orange County Courthouse, where her murderer, Mark Keith Lloyd, was sentenced to death today. Lieutenant Clayton's family believing now she may rest in peace because they say justice has been served. Thank you, Lord, that justice has been served today. It's been a long five years for Lieutenant Deborah Clayton's family, living through two murder trials and countless hearings in the case of the state of Florida versus Markeith Lloyd, where a judge I could have sentenced you to death. gave him a final sentence of death. He just took someone so much away from me that it hurts, but I'm happy. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Now we may, now she can rest in peace. Lieutenant Clayton's family celebrating her life in court by wearing pink. Pink was her favorite color. She loved pink nails. She always would wear the pink nails. She loved pink. And I love her. I miss her and I'm so glad. I'm so glad. And honoring her legacy as a community officer with Orlando Police Department. Lieutenant Clayton shopping at an Orlando Walmart for her anniversary dinner when she was gunned down by Lloyd in January of 2017. As you all know, she was an incredible person. Um, she took her job very seriously. She loved her family. She was about family at the end of the day. And there, no, there will be nobody like her, I'll put it that way. After Lloyd was sentenced to death, he too looked up to the sky and started yet one more tangent. <laughs> All I could think about was my sister in that courtroom and I blocked him out because that's just all a show, all a act. <laughs> Yelling as officers escorted him back to jail, now headed to death row. Be thankful. Our whole family's thankful. So it's important to note that neither Lloyd's family or defense team wanted to speak to us outside of court today, but we are told that appeals are already being filed. In Orlando, I'm Nadine Yanis, getting results, News 6. And as you probably know, Lieutenant Clayton was so well respected among the community and her law enforcement family, many of them in court today, including Orange County Sheriff John Mina, who was the chief of police back in 2017. Now it's time for Marquis Floyd to suffer for 23 hours a day uh, in a cell, not knowing when that uh, death sentence is, is going to come. Sheriff Mina says he does not believe what Lloyd tried to say in a note passed to him during the trial. That note released today reading, quote, I never wanted to kill her, but I believe the police were trying to kill me. The sheriff hopes to keep building on Lieutenant Clayton's work in the community. Lieutenant Deborah Clayton uh, was a mentor to the children in his community. Uh, her whole law enforcement career was dedicated uh, to building trust within the community, building those bridges, and we hope she's, she's resting in peace now. Our coverage on today's sentencing reaction and what comes next continues at clickorlando.com. Search for the stories on the homepage.